Hey guys, so after the longest time I have a technology video for you. Uh, it's been well over the year, so I'm really happy that I can bring you some technology. My name is Tomáš Fuk and this is a casual nerd channel. So last week my colleague at work approached me about his graphics card doesn't work. Uh, this is an actually Hewitt Packard uh, GTX 580. So it's quite old, but uh, that's his main graphics card. And he said it's actually turning off after about 10 minutes. So that's actually tell me that uh, there are two ways that three, three ways that th this can go. Uh, either his power supply is gone. There is a bad thermo thermo paste over here or some different problem with this cooler or it's dead. So he asked me to find out which is which. So that's exactly what we are going to do today. So let's turn my baby off and start with some testing, shall we? Okay guys, so this card has some serious, serious problem. Uh, from what I found in Google, here in Valley Benchmark it shouldn't supposed to have a problem with it and it's supposed to have right about 60 fps but we are only getting as you can see two or three of them. The other really weird part is and I have Valley Benchmark on really really low settings yeah and it's four by three monitors so it's you know not really demanding and the weird thing is here in GPU-Z it doesn't even show its clocks but as you can see the temperatures are okay so yeah that's really weird so and the last stuff I want to show you is that oh, minimize yeah. Uh, on the dark places it has this uh, I don't know if you can see it yeah those those blue lines in the dark dark parts yeah that's indicators that the cart is gone so I have one or two uh, test test in my in my sleeve uh, yeah now I will try to flash flash the card with another BIOS and we shall see what's gonna happen yeah yes yeah, so I already back, backed up the original one from GPU Z and yeah, it's really nice tool from this part I already download uh, I already download the uh, new BIOS or something similar and the utility code NV flash. That's what I need to extract. Uh, I already have it extracted somewhere. So, oh my, yeah, there is it. NV flash. So, let's try it. Okay, so and we flash and file name. Okay, so I need to get the file over here. So let's see. There, where is it? Where is it? And we flash. Oh, I'm just yeah here like this. So and we flash. Um, huh. Okay, so copy blah 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 checking for the matches between spin up there and up there five eighty blah 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 
the EEPROM ID, okay, what if your image must be adapted PCS system ID? Okay, so I need 10 DE947. Can I? Mm, okay, so let's try this one. This looks a little bit better. So it's happening. I'm really, I just really want to see if it's going to help or not. Cross my fingers. A bit is required to take the effect. Okay, so yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't look like it really helped. There is still lots of it. Yeah. I will, I'll wait if the uh, heaven benchmark is get better, but I don't really think so. Okay, guys, so that didn't help at all. It, we are, yeah, maybe a little bit. We are on three FPS now, not on two. Yeah, but still really bad. So the last thing that left is try to bake the card, but first we need to disassemble it. So let's turn this puppy off. Shut down, yeah. And okay, so I already partially disassembled the card, uh, but I didn't have the appropriate Torx screws, but that has been the found, so I can continue now. So I need this one. So thermal, thermal pads are completely gone, like completely gone. Okay, so this is a PCB, but as you can see, the thermal pads are yeah, mostly gone. I will try to salvage them, but I'm really not sure if this is even possible. guys yeah, it's completely possible that it's actually wasn't working because virtually no thermal dissipation from the most fats yeah, wow yeah, I will take it on the recompressor I'm just taking the biggest parts over there. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. This is in much worse state that I could have imagined. Wow, just actually wow. Okay, so guys, the card is baked. Yeah, for 200 degrees, oh, I'm sorry, uh, for 200 degrees of Celsius for about seven minutes. So I hope it was enough. So we can start to put things back together. I also cleaned yeah, the term this part and straightened the thermopads as best as I could, but. Yeah, this is only for testing purposes. This couldn't work for any, any measure of time. This is just to find out if baked worked. And then there is need to buy new thermal pads and reapply them. So, yeah, let's start to get this baby back together. Okay, so first these connectors. No, only this one, uh, this connector. Yeah, that's, that's for the fan. So this should go on like so. Yeah, so start screwing this down. So oh. yeah, only finger tight. There is no need for uh, really strong force. The finger tight is actually okay. So. Oh yeah, okay, so this is done. So there is the cooler that should go in like this. Yeah, okay, so you need thermal paste. Yeah, you know, for GPU you need much more than for the CPU, so... And just put here some Mount Rushmore or something, yeah, like so. I'm actually satisfied with this, so now put back the cooler, so... Yeah, so that's in for good. So last piece is this stuff. And then the front. Yeah, so there is like a billion of them. Okay, so let's try it on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, touch me, babe. I can feel your eyes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Show me piano. Show me working in my show. Show me the car. 
Yeah, but for now, no blue lines. That looks good. Or at least better. So guys, we are booted up. And look, there are no blue lines. So, this looks promising. This actually looks really promising. Uh, no, no, yes. No, no, mm, go away, where, 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 where are you, you exit, you shut down into the reboot, yes, and this is put it up, yeah, this is no, you can see the graphics card, and there is my dog, <laughs> yeah, so, I have to burn her. Hell yeah! MSI Afterburner now can see everything here. GPU, GPU, GPU. Oh yes. You can even overclock it still. So, where is Heaven Benchmark? Run. Remember, last time this, this was like 2 or 3 FPS. So, we shall see now. Hell yeah! 162. Whoa! <laughs> Great success! Yes! Yes, 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 great success! Okay guys, so this was a really, really successful experiment. I'm so happy that we managed to make this card work again, so... It was a little bit of pain. I was hoping that uh, it wouldn't come for baking the card, but you know, it's it's really good. It's uh, fine. Card is working, so that's great. Only stuff that uh, the thermal pads needs to be changed because they are just completely destroyed. But I can do that for him uh, in the office after work. So I'll just tell him what to buy. And what to order and uh, the day that we uh, decided to change it I just take my stuff to do work and change it in the office so that's that's the minimal but yeah car is fully functional probably not for that long as it used to be but it's functional so yeah I'm looking forward to make, make some similar Great technical content, but for the foreseeable future, it's probably going to be a casual building downstairs. So, yeah, but for now, thank you, like it, share it, watch it. Bye bye.